Hi, we're back here at Powerplex 14 here in Grand Rapids, Michigan. We're here with uh, Gabby Hills and Brianna Remington, the ladies of Green Flash Brewery. I'm actually a fan. I'm actually a love Road Warrior. I know it just came out. Uh, but let's talk a little bit about Plex. Um, how did you guys get started with Plex? I'll let Bree start on that. Yeah, I came on board to Green Flash in February of 2013 to lead the implementation process of an ERP system and the selection process. So, so you started from scratch saying, we need an ERP system. Yeah. We're growing really fast and yeah. we need something. Yeah. What were you doing before? Um, I was a system analyst for Workday okay. and previously with Salesforce. Got it. And what was Green Flash using? Um, Green Flash was using Excel and QuickBooks when I came on board. Wow, real good tools. Yeah. I use them myself uh, in my small awesome company. Awesome tools yeah. for a small company, but not a rapidly growing. We were one. outgrowing them, so. Yeah. So, and you guys were growing what thirty percent year over year. I mean, you're doing some really phenomenal growth. Yeah. yeah. So, so you put in. I mean, you put in Plex. Uh, how did it work? I mean, what went through the selection process? Let's start there. Like, what yeah. were you choosing between? Um, we had a list of 15 ERP systems, so we really branched out and looked beyond our industry to see what other manufacturers were doing and using. Um, so we had a huge list. We narrowed it down to four. I don't know if you want to know them. Yeah, but who's yeah. in the shortlist? Yeah. <laughs> I'm curious. Flex made the shortlist. Um, expandable, oh, yeah. Rootstock, expandable, Rootstock, and... Orchestrated beer. Orchestrated beer. Was so you wanted to be in the cloud space. One. Yeah. yeah. Two were cloud, two were legacy, and yeah. the final two were one of each. So it was Plex and a legacy system. Very cool. And you world. look at fulfillment and fulfillment systems. What happens on that end? So. so I do all the purchasing planning for all of our merchandise. So that's to distributor network and consumer network. So I use Plex for purchasing and customer orders and shipping and receiving. So I was very excited to get out of Excel and onto an ERP system. Well, and it's a tough world, right? In distribution, you're right. doing two tier, three tier distribution, exactly. depending on the states. People are faxing orders to you still. Yes. Right, are they still doing that faxing. now? Tech, yes. <laughs> <laughs> Very relaxed industry in the beer, you know? So yeah. they're going, I need, I need this. But, I need two um, cases. I need yeah, a couple exactly. Cases. So wrangling them into that system has been a challenge, but I think we've done pretty well so far. Okay, so that's cool. You guys are launching a brand new plan, I believe, out in Virginia, I believe? Or? Yeah, Virginia Beach. We have a facility opening in 2016. So you're going to be bi-coastal, San Diego and Virginia Beach. Yeah. Um, how's that look like for Plex? Are you putting the Plex system in there? Yes, we're um, trying to lay the groundwork. We've got Plex implemented, but we've got a few more things to refine before we expand. So we're working on all of those things, which is why we're excited to be here at PowerPlex. No, that's great. Now, yeah. when the original implementation, how long did it take? Like you joined 2013, you're here as a customer yeah. speaking. <laughs> that seems like it must have been a quick process. This wasn't like two years to implement, right? No, it was a four month implementation. Yeah, we did it in four months. <laughs> wow. Yeah. The selection process was four months. So itself. the selection process took longer than the implementation. Yeah. Wow, that's something That's something to let the people know. So yeah. any advice for people that are actually doing a Plex implementation, uh, what would you suggest from what you guys did? Um, I think the requirements gathering is essential and making sure that you have, you know, we, we're very similar in how we process things, but obviously the brewers have different needs, that, you yes. know, so making sure you have representatives from every department and getting their requirements before you start the selection process. Yeah, that went a long way um, with identifying what solutions were going to be um, met with an ERP system versus what were people in process and so understanding our own Take the time company. to plan, yeah. involve lots exactly. of different people along the way. It's okay that the implementation is going to be a little bit... Was that four months for planning and implementation? Um, yeah. Yeah. Wow. The so the actual yeah, implementation yeah. was actually even shorter than that. Yeah. I, well, we did, well, we did the requirements gathering. It was two months when I came on board, then two months of the selection process, and four months of an implementation. Wow. Yeah. Okay. No, great advice. Yeah. Thank you so much for yeah, being here. Of course. Uh, here in Grand Rapids for PowerPlex 2014 with Green Flash Brewery. I'm a road warrior. So <laughs> what's your favorite Sorry. beer? Oh, it depends. Um, I love West Coast IPA, though. West Coast IPA? I Staple. did the East, East Village Pilsner. East Village Pilsner. Okay, yeah. well, hey, thank you very much for being here at PowerPlex thank 2014. You. Thank you.